So here's what we're going to do. We're going to do a quick show called the Mini Manual. Now, coincidentally, or not coincidentally, I've got two guns here that both use LED boards, okay? I've got the Dai DM10, uses an LED board, and I just got this in today. This is the new um, rendition Victory. So I don't know if you guys have seen this yet. Just got it in today. And of course, both of these use LED boards. Now, one of the biggest problems with LED boards is if you don't have your manual or you forget your manual and you get out to the field and you need to change a setting, whether your rate of fire is too high or the dwell's quite not right or the trigger's bouncing or something like that, a lot of times if you don't remember your manual, well, then you're kind of screwed. Well, I got an idea for you guys. Here's what I want you to do. Read the manual, and we'll just do the uh, the die because it's a little bit easier, okay? A lot of people don't know, okay, what is blue? What is yellow? What is uh, green? What is red? What you do is you open up Microsoft Word, and in very small font, like size 6, okay? You put on there, um, you know, green trigger sensitivity, default is 3. Dwell is red, default is 18. Rate of fire. Now, you obviously want to know what you're, if you're doing capped or uncapped or whatever. Let's say, for instance, now you're going to play the PSP. The rate of fire is 20 clicks, and that's 12 and a half balls per second. So you put on there 20 equals 12.5, and then you put underneath it uh, 45 clicks is 33 balls per second if you want to do semi. And then on yellow, you put on there, you know, one, two, three, and four is semi auto, millennium, PSP, and full auto. Well, here's what you do print the, print it up, and it's gonna be small. It's gonna be maybe the size of a business card if you're lucky. Take some tape, like uh, box tape, or you can even use scotch tape. You know, take it, set the DM down, and then what you'll do is, is you'll take the tape and put it over. The plate, you know, the area that you printed. Okay. Then what you do is take your scissors, cut it out. Now you can fold this up a couple times, stick it into your grip frame, and then you know put your grip screws, but you know put your grips back on. And then now you always have your manual with you. Now if you ever get to the field, and you're like, oh shit, I don't know what I got to do. You know, my my gun is bouncing, or my rate of fire is too high, or something like that. You can open up your grip frame really quick, take a look at your little mini manual, read what you've got to change on it, fold it back up, put it back into your grip, adjust your gun, and you're ready to go. So hopefully that helps you guys uh, when you're dealing with LED boards. Is make the mini manual, put it in like font four or five or six. Whatever, whatever printer you're using, print it up on the nice little corner of the paper here. Uh, take some box tape or scotch tape and protect it so that, you know, if it gets wet or moist or whatever, cut it out nice and small, fold it up a couple times, stick it down into your grip, and you'll be good to go. So that's the uh, little show we're going to call the mini manual.